Hey guys, we are going to do a five minute glute workout that's going to get your booty right. We'll do a series of five different exercises for 30 seconds each and you'll have a little bit of time to recover in between. So the first exercise is a simple squat, okay? You wanna make sure that your feet are about shoulder width apart and you wanna squat down and come up. You wanna make sure that your heels are not coming off the ground when you're doing this movement, okay? And we're ready, and let's go. Press through your heels to come up, and you wanna also make sure that you are not allowing your torso to bend over, okay? So down and up. Keep that chest high and proud. We're almost there. Breathe through. We have five, three, and one. Okay, so we're gonna take it down to the floor for a glute bridge, okay? We're lying on our back, your palms are touching the floor, bent knees, and what we're gonna do is bring our hips off the floor as high up as you can get them. Up and down and up and down. It's all about keeping your hips tight and we're really getting a good workout in our glute area. Are you ready? Let's do it. And drive in through your heels to come all the way up. You wanna get a full extension of the hip here, okay? And breathe through it. I know it's burning. Exhale at the top, let it out. And inhale and let it out. 10 more seconds, we're doing good. You got this. And three, two, and one. Okay, next we're gonna go into kickbacks. So we're here on all fours. You wanna make sure that your sole is parallel to the ceiling. So it's going to look like this. And we're gonna alternate. Go at your own pace. Keep the belly tight. Pull that navel into your spine. Okay, we're ready to do this. We have five more seconds and we're gonna start. And let's go. Take your time. Make sure that you're breathing through these moments. It's very key. And up, use your hamstring to lift that leg. You wanna get it as high as possible. I'm gonna raise the leg to the ceiling. 10 seconds, you can do it, stay with me. You got this. Five, four, three, and we're done. Okay, next exercise, we're bringing it up. We're going to do a side lunge. The key here is you wanna make sure that both feet stay facing forward, okay? So we're gonna here and come back to center. And back to center. Simple enough, right? Hey guys, I'm gonna take you through a quick five minute ab routine that's going to get your core right and tight. We'll do a series of five different exercises, each for 30 seconds, and you'll have some time to take a break in between. So, are we ready? Let's go. The first exercise is a crunch with a tap. So you'll bring your hands behind your ears here. We're going to come up into a crunch and tap to your right, back to center and down. Let's go. Crunch up and tap. Bring it back and down, up, tap and down. You want to make sure that you keep on breathing. Make sure that your eyes are to the ceiling, okay? You don't want to pull your neck in towards your chest. We have five seconds. Three, two, and one. Okay, catch your breath, and I'll be demonstrating the next exercise. We're going to do a plank here. I'm sure most of you have seen this before. It's very easy, but there's a few different ways you can do it. You can do a high plank. You want to make sure that your hands are directly beneath your shoulders, okay? If this is a little too difficult, you can bring it down into a forearm plank and you can clasp here if you need to. Get ready. We're going to go for 30 seconds and go. 
Make sure that you're breathing. Pull your belly in, and you want to make sure that your hips are not sinking, okay? You want to make a straight line from your heels to your head. All right, and if you need to, you can come up into a high plank here. We have eight more seconds, let's go. Keep holding, you can do it. In five, four, three, two, one. Nice job. Next, we're gonna go into scissor leg drops. You want to lay flat on the mat, and we're gonna bring both feet up, and you want to try your best to keep your legs as straight as possible. You're gonna bring one leg down and alternate. Are we ready? We're going in three, two, and one. Let's go. Remember, make sure to keep those legs straight and we're going to breathe. Where do I feel this the most? Focus on your abdominals. Don't worry, we're almost there. We have 10 seconds. Like you're kicking through the air. And five, three, two, and one. How are we feeling? Are you ready for the next one? Okay, so this one is called a sit-up and reach. So it's just a twist on the regular sit-up. We're gonna come down, arms overhead. We're gonna do a sit-up and reach for the sky. And back down. Are we ready? Let's do it. And you're going to exhale on your way up. Inhale down, exhale on the way up. Let it out. We're almost there. And remember, you can move at your own pace. Don't feel like you have to go really fast. Go at a pace that suits you. And three, two, and one. We're ready for the last one. We're almost there. We're going into plank jack. So this is like a plank, but we're adding a jumping jack into it. Now, if you need to modify, you can just tap out and in. Tap out and in, tap out and in. All right, this is it, we're going for it. This is our last exercise, we have 30 seconds. Give it all you got and let's go. Just have fun with this. And again, you want to make sure that your hips are not dipping, okay? 